Good afternoon, my name is Denise Lewis. Today I'll be showing you how to properly scan a document into the computer. First you need three things. You need to have your document. You need to have a printer, scanner, all in one, all in five that you can find at your local Staples, Target, Walmart, any store like that. Make sure that it's properly hooked up to your computer. Once you do that, you can run a property test and it will give you a printout to make sure that your scanner is reading properly and communicating with your computer. First you take your document, make sure that it's in the proper fashion that you would like it. My printer, all in one, is particularly, I have it on copy, scanner, fax, or photo mode. So I want to make sure that it's on scan mode. You push the scan. Mine particularly tells me to just put it in and say push start. Make sure it's face down on the screen, shut your lid, and press start. While it's requesting to scan to the computer, you can always run and go to your start button on the far left at the bottom. You can go to faxes and scans, and it'll also prompt you to be able to start the fax. You'll hear noises in the back. Now scanning it to the computer. Once it's completed the scan, a box will pop up on your computer screen and it'll give you options if your document is inverted or upside down. You can rotate left or rotate right and you can just get it properly set up. You go to your save button. The computer is going to automatically give it a file name for you whether it's the date, the time, or any other number. I'm not going to remember the date or the time, so I want to save this under a name that I know what it is. This is a certificate, so I'm going to save it under certificate because I'll remember that. Clear out your file name and just type in what you want to save it as. I type search. It's the only one I have right now, so I just want to make sure I got that in there. The file you're saving, yes I do. Now I can exit out of this program. It's going to give me an option to save anything else, but I don't need to at this time. So if you're not sure that you saved it, you can always go up under your documents under the Start button again on the left-hand side at the bottom, and you can go into Documents or Recent Documents, and it'll show you what you just downloaded. Today you learned how to properly scan a document into the computer. Make sure you take that document out of the computer though. You don't want nobody else to scan your stuff. I'm Denise. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask. Thanks for attending. Have a great day.